can think of. I mean, let's see. What else happened? The Jets lost. We knew that. Oh, you mean oh. this one. We got to start in Nashville, ladies and gents. Chiefs, Titans, first drive of the game. Derrick Henry runs. Derrick Henry, also pretty good football player. He had a touchdown pass from King Henry yesterday. Titans did anything they wanted. Derrick Henry's throwing <clears throat> touchdowns. They're molly whopping. The Titans 14-0 before the end of the first quarter. Chiefs defense still a problem. Chiefs turnover still a problem. Two more for Mahomes yesterday. He was picked off for the sixth straight game, his longest INT streak ever. Also got hurt at the end of this one. We're going to have more on that in a second. The Titans had their way with the Chiefs. 27-3 was your final. After the game, Patrick Mahomes on where the three and four Chiefs go from here. It's been uh, kind of uh, rainbows and flowers and awesome for these last few years, but uh, whenever you want to build something substantial and you want to build something great, it, you're going to go through parts like this. And, um, I mean, it's still, we, people keep saying it's still early in the year. I mean, we're, we're still, we can still go get whatever we want, um, but it's going to take us getting better every single day um, because if you get better every single day and play each game play by play, uh, I think we have the talent in this locker room that we can, we can make it happen. All right, so as we mentioned earlier, Mahomes got knocked out of this game on a nasty hit to the head in the fourth quarter. It actually looked like he snapped his neck back. It looked painful. He didn't return, but he did clear concussion protocol, which is great news for Patrick Mahomes. But, Nick, they got problems. Should the Chiefs be in full-blown panic mode at this time? Well, Jenna, I don't know what the audience expects me to say here, but... And I don't know if the Chiefs are in full-blown panic mode, but I am. What the hell do they do all week? Here's the thing. Guess what, guys? I, 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 if I hadn't watched a Giants game all year, if I'd never watched football, I could tell them, guess what the Giants are going to do? They're going to play too high safety and make you take short gains. That's going to be their defense. On offense, they're going to play action pass you to death and throw in the flat and intermediate over the middle. That's what the Giants are gonna do next week. And I have no reason to believe the Chiefs are gonna be prepared for it because it's what everyone has done every week. I don't, I, I don't know if this team practices. I, I can deal with the bad defense. I saw a team that should have won the Super Bowl three years ago have a historically bad defense. The bad defense all year long, I've said, we'll deal with it. What I can't deal with, Broussard, is three points. I can't deal with the offense, forget not looking unstoppable, the offense looking stuck in the mud from word go. They spend all their money on offensive linemen, the Titans don't blitz ever, and they just keep getting to Mahomes. Right. No one can get open, no one can block, no one can run, and the defense is terrible. So if I sound a little less confident than I have in the past, it's because I thought they, the Titans secondary was missing everyone. Scored three points. So, yeah, I'm a little panicked. I'm a little upset. Your guys' all collective wow. glee is a borderline HR violation. We all, we do work together. No. I don't appreciate it. This but, yeah, not glee. I'm a little panicked. This is my sorry. resting face. I, I see. Uh -huh. yeah. I, first of all, let me say this. Jenna and, and Wilds, <laughs> I can't tell you how delighted I was yesterday. Not that the Chiefs got destroyed but that I wasn't watching the game with Nick because I, I didn't think I could handle another afternoon of having him lay on my shoulder and patting him on his head as he cried, which oh. is what happened last time okay. we watched that, the Chiefs lost together. Happen. So that, I, I, was, I was happy that that wasn't the case. You start the week um, off with but lies. I, Nick, I, I'm surprised that you are in full-blown panic mode. I guess I get it because it's been Super Bowl or bust. I would say... Panic mode is just a smidgen too much. Whatever's below panic mode, uh, uh, in distress, disquieted, under duress, what, major concern, like mm -hmm. I, that's where Chiefs fans should be. Because I'm not ready to say they're not going to make the playoffs. And if they make the playoffs, that means to some degree they've fixed some things. And once you get there, especially when you got Pat Mahomes, you got a chance. So I, I, I'm not in full-blown panic mode, but obviously they got issues. And I'll say this, 
Yesterday was the first time all season. Because remember, I picked the Chiefs to go to the Super Bowl, too, to win it. Yesterday was the first time, Wilds, that I really became worried about the Chiefs. Even after Buffalo, I was like, they'll, they're fine. They'll get it together. Yesterday was the first time. And I got to say something about Pat Mahomes. Jenna mentioned the six games with a turnover, three straight now with multiple turnovers. And I think Mahomes is in that space where you could see it in the game where he was trying to do too much to overcompensate for the defense, but then battling within himself between playing off instinct and making all the crazy throws he does or being right. too cautious. And I thought it happened at halftime because in the first half, when he fumbled, I felt like I could hear him thinking, should I slide or should I go for these extra yards? We need them. And he fumbles. He goes for the yards, fumbles. So then in the second half, Wiles, I thought he was like being too cautious. Like It's like telling Steph Curry, don't take wild off-balance threes. Well, that's a part of Steph Curry. And Pat Mahomes has become Patrick Mahomes. Super Bowl champion, MVP, best quarterback in the league by going, doing these crazy things, making these wild, uh, ill-advised throws. Playing and fearless. you heard him after the game. We can't make 14-point plays. We can't try to do too much. That's what he does. That's what's made him who he is. So he's concerned. So everyone should be concerned, Wilds, but not quite panic mode. Okay, Broussard, you are the band member on the Titanic. Like, I'm not panicking yet, guys. Like, ah, uh, it's time to panic. The place is going down. Broussard, oh, we got another song to play, fellas. No, it's time to be in <laughs> full-blown panic mode. And Nick... Me and Dusty cooked up a little graphic for you. We were going to call it Nick's Tears, T-E-A-R-S. We were going to be like 20 and 0, question mark. We just went a little bit safer. We called it Kansas City Troubles. Just nice and easy if we can reveal Kansas City Troubles. There's three things you really need to be worried about. And within that, a hundred other things. Oh, you don't protect the ball anymore. You got a league high 17 giveaways. Uh, Mahomes leads the league with nine interceptions. Just for the record, it's more than Cardinals, Bills, and the Bucks combined have less than 17 giveaways. So that's mm. not great. That's not great. And here's the thing. I need to correct something. A lot of people are out there, Nick, saying that the Chiefs have the worst defense in the league. That is just a flat out lie. If we can show how bad their defense is, however, it's not great. They're 28th in total yards. They do allow a touchdown more than everybody else in the league. If we can show the graphic here, Pepper, <laughs> this is a little bit of a rough ride. So if you have children in the room, you might want to move them out or just say, hey, you know what? This is just a grown-up show. You don't want to hear this. Points per game tied 27. Yards per game 28. Passes 26. Rush 27. They allow touchdowns on 33% in the drives. And now, as you mentioned, they also can't score. That, that's not great either, let's be honest with you. It's since the Super Bowl, they're three and five. Uh, Mahomes has not been Mahomes. I said he looks looks like a sneakerhead working at the sneaker store, giving everybody the Patrick price. But Nick, <laughs> this is not great either. So the question to you is this. Are you more worried about Patrick Mahomes or are you more worried about the defense? If you had to pick one, I know it's tough. I know it's tough, but which horrible thing about the Chiefs are you worried about more right now? Well, listen, I, what I'm most worried about is right now, they're so bad, they have the same record as the Patriots, and I can't stomach oh. that. I can't handle it. I'd down. rather they have a worse record than the Patriots than be tied with the Patriots. But I listen, Patrick will be fine. However, I, I'm going to go reiterate what I said at the beginning. What teams are doing is not complex. They are running the play action pass at a super high rate because the Chiefs linebackers look like they didn't know that was allowed. And they are running this same too high safety look that, by the way, teams tried to do against the Chiefs last year and Kansas City picked it apart. So no, I can't puff my chest out here and say I'm totally convinced everything will be okay because yesterday's game was such an abomination. I, uh, the Ravens game, the Chargers game, I actually don't. You guys know in real time. 
I wasn't concerned at all. They played well enough to win those games. They had bad fourth down luck. They had bad fumble luck. Those things happen against good teams. The Titans are a good but far from great team that you knew exactly what they were going to do. Run Derrick Henry around 30 times to play action pass over the middle. They couldn't stop it. They have a secondary that stunk when it was healthy that was without four of its top seven guys. And the Chiefs couldn't move the football. So what am I most concerned about right now? Right now it's the coaching, to be totally honest. It is the coach's wow. jobs to put the team no, in position to know what's coming mm. and to be prepared for it. We all knew what was coming. And for them to react.